Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be, um, hold on. Today I'm going to be, um, drawing one of these, and I already drew these with these wood sand markers, which I've seen in a video before. I'm not sponsored by anything, but I'm gonna be doing, working with these, and some of my markers and color pencils in here. And I drew these pictures, these pictures. Um, I drew this one with these and this one with these. The both of these with only these markers. Um, so yeah, I don't know which one to draw and I don't wanna do a hard one, but this one's not really that hard. I know how to draw it, but that one's too easy. So I'm gonna cl close my eyes and pick one and I don't really care which one, so. I'm actually gonna mix it up. I don't know. I'm closing my eyes. Okay. Okay, this one. <gasps> Yay, I got the butterfly one. It'll be a longer video though, so let's get started. So first you're gonna take your black marker, your Sharpie, Posca pen, wood sand pen, pencil, even if you want a pencil, colored pencil, as long as it's black for the outline. So yeah, I'm gonna get my black from here. So first we're going to, here's an example, if you wanna just freehand it. Um, first we're gonna draw the face. And pretty much, you're just gonna draw two circles and whatever eyes you want, and then a curve on top, and then just that, and then the smile. And I'll see you after that. So I think this butterfly is gonna come out better just because I had a thicker marker, but this is mine. And then now we're just gonna draw the little antennas, and you're just gonna draw a line and curl it and do it kind of close to each other just like that and i actually um draw so cute i followed her tutorial and now i'm making it my own tutorial but i'm going to do mine a little different i did definitely color mine way different than hers different hers was blue purples and i think pink yeah blue purple and pink and then i just went all out and did this and my dad line wasn't as long so now what we're gonna do is we're just gonna draw a oval like thing with little curved stripes in them all right now we're going to draw the wings and don't draw a straight line through the face just draw a line and then pick up your pencil and draw a line it should go way out and stop here and the same with the other side so these wings are definitely not even. This one goes way down, this one goes straight, which you can do either one. I guess this could be an example. And I, what I did is I shaded it to make it look better, but I don't know if I can change this one. So now what we're gonna do is we're going to make this little outline here for each, on each side. So let's do that. I didn't make mine that big, but for yours, for tips, Make sure to follow the outline really good and don't leave a lot of space like me. And over here, I could have done a way bigger space and way fatter, but this is a tutorial and I have to learn from my mistakes. So now we're gonna draw two little bumpy things here and three here. Same with these. Oh, my camera's blurry. Okay, now we're going to draw hearts and then three dots all around, just like that. This one's definitely, mm, this one's definitely, <laughs> I kind of did my own replay. Um, just kept tapping the pen. This one's definitely, um, back to my thing. Uh, this one's definitely way better because this one's thick and this one's like, smaller and thinner because this is not a Posca pin, but 
it would be better this way, but just the wings are kind of weird. But this one is finished, so. And the face is kind of wider, but this is how it's really supposed to look, so. Do that one, not this one, really. So now I'm gonna add this dotted line, and I'm gonna add like it all swervy. And however much paper you have left, that's how much you're gonna do. So this is how I did mine, and it goes curves, curves. Oops, did that wrong. Curves, 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 and it would keep going because he like flies like that. And don't do any on the top. Well, actually, you can if you want to make, like, a track where he's going to go. But I just like to do at the bottom. Uh, you can either start off going down like this, down like this, or, like, up, or straight. So, enough talking. It's time to put some flowers and hearts on the background. You don't have to do this, but I'm just going to do it for decoration. All right, you can do any flowers you want, any hearts you want. I just like to do simple, easy ones. Um, yeah, now I'm going to get to coloring. So you can do coloring however you want. I did mine totally different from Draw So Cutes, and mine is a lot colorful, very colorful. <sighs> but... I'm gonna draw the decoration, color the decorations first and get back to y'all. So I did the decorations and I always do them the same colors, either pink or red. Um, I do the hearts the same color as the flower, but the hearts are from these markers and then these flowers, all the colors from the flowers are from my wood sand markers and I'm not sponsored by Crayola. Would Sam, I'm not really sponsored by anything because I'm a small YouTuber. No one really watches me. Oh, and by the way, I'm giving out, I'm giving a shout out to Jason Matthew. He's been so active on my account and he just comments nice things. So yeah, now I'm going to color the outside of the, the butterfly. So I'll be back. Okay, I don't normally do shout outs, but that shout out was just because he's so active and no one really else no one else is really that active except for this other person. I don't know what their name is, but um they're not really active. They comment on on like two of my videos. So Jason Matthew comments on every video as soon as he can. I'm pretty sure because two minutes after I upload it I upload it and then like he's already commenting on my video. So that's really awesome. Thank you, Jason Matthew, for being so active. And that's your shout out. Everyone that's watching this, go subscribe to him. I don't know if he have, I don't think he has any videos, but subscribe anyway, because he's such an awesome person and he supports my channel so much. So do that, guys. Do that. Excuse the TV on, and by the way, if you heard music, um, all rights reserved to that person. I don't know who it was by, but yeah, if you heard music, hopefully I don't get copyrighted. I'm just a small YouTuber. <laughs> Anyways, we're gonna add pink, pink middle. All right, that's good for now. Um, gotta close my cap. Um, that is, oh no. When did that happen? Oh, whatever. Um, yeah. All right, you guys, I did the same orange color as on this one. Um, but now I'm gonna outline it once it dries because, yeah. Oh wait, that's the wrong marker because it kind of went out the lines. All right, you guys, um, outline to that. I also had to outline that one whenever I did it. 
Um, but now I'm going to color the hearts, dots, and the insides of this. So I colored the inside with my pink Crayola color pencils, which are awesome, but I'm not sponsored. And these markers were also Crayola, not sponsored. So now I'm going to color the face and the other stuff. All right, so I did green dots, blue hearts. None of this matches, but it's still cute. And now I'm going to do the face. I had no idea what to do face, so I just did it with my colored pencils, yellow, copied off of this one whatever that's how you draw and maybe if you want to color it the same way or any of this um a butterfly and you could also add just designs if you did big ones like me on accident you could add designs to the outlines which i'm going to do now all right i added some white dots and they turned out light purple i still like it um sorry this video was so long but it was definitely worth it it was like 11 minutes and like whatever but it's definitely worth it, and make sure to like, subscribe, turn on the notification bell so you know whenever I'm uploading cool videos like this, and maybe I'll do more drawing videos, so bye guys.